What's up guys, it's Cody over at Form First Fitness, just dropping another quick garage tutorial. Today we are going to talk about clamshells, okay? So clamshells are a great movement, both for warm-up, rehab, and just some hip opening or hip activation, okay? This also is a good movement for you if you have any low back pain or kind of a tight piriformis muscle in that low back kind of upper butt area, all right? It also gets some nice oblique engagement if we do this for higher repetitions. So what we're going to do is we are going to get on our side, kind of like we're setting up for a side plank. So my elbow is down on the ground, my shoulders stacked right over my elbow, and then I have my forearm coming out to the side. Now, very important, I want you to try to firmly press through that pinky so that the entire forearm stays connected to the ground, okay? If that forearm starts lifting throughout the movement, we put a lot of tension, a lot of pressure on that elbow, it becomes very uncomfortable very quickly, okay? If you're having difficulty keeping that forearm down, use that opposite hand to kind of press at the wrist, okay? So now that we have that bottom arm set up, and we have that forearm completely connected to the ground, you're gonna notice that I have a slight bend in my knees, okay? So if I'm setting up for a normal side plank, this is my posture, right? I'm gonna bring that bottom hip down and I'm gonna bend my knees to about 90 degrees. My feet are stacked right on top of each other, knees are stacked, all right? And I'm pressing through that bottom hip. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to press through my forearm, right? not my elbow, the entire forearm, and I'm going to pick up my bottom hip, and simultaneously, as that hip comes up, I'm going to raise that top knee, okay? So what it's gonna look like is I'm pressing through my feet, I'm pressing through that forearm, the hip comes up, and that top knee comes up. So I'm getting a lot of glute activation out of that bottom leg, and we're getting some good oblique activation from the core or the obliques that are facing down, okay? Then, as my top knee comes down, I relax my hip so it comes to a nice soft touch, drive through that bottom leg, hip top knee comes high, bottom hip lifts off the ground. And one more time, smooth and controlled. Once again, if that elbow is a little tight, the one that's pressing from the ground. If you have a pad available, just bring that pad in. And so we have a little extra cushion, okay? But one more time, drive that bottom hip up, that top knee flares out, and we create this clamshell with our legs. If you guys like the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.